Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Finn, and welcome to all of the new features that are coming into Forza Horizon 4. Now, if you don't know, a YouTube ch channel who is known as Forza Motorsport, who makes a game called well, the game brand Forza uploaded a few episodes of a news <laughs> series called Seasons Change Everything. Now, this basically just went through absolutely every single new f feature that was coming, in, c coming into Forza Horizon f f f 4. As well as its most important part, which was well, there was going to be four episodes of this series to count on the four seasons: spring, summer, autumn, or fall, or winter. So there are a lot of f f f things which I will be going f f f through, and usually I do have a face cam. But the face cam's not really, uh, it's not going to be in use for a, a little while. Um, I've kind of broken my camera, so excuse me for that. Everything that will be said will be as detailed yet as simple as possible. So let's st start off because. There's a lot to go through. Let's start off with the most important part of Fox Horizon 4, which is the seasons. So, just like what real life is, there's going to be four seasons. Spring, summer, autumn, slash fall, and winter, which is pretty normal. These seasons will change every week in real life, and this will also d depend on which part of, of, of the world you're in. These different seasons also c get c combined with, with different types of wildlife as well. For example, during the different s seasons, you will also have sounds of different birds that usually happen within that year which actually are the birds in, in the UK so if you're expecting a pelican then sorry although there is a pelican from Halo in Forest Horizon 4 sadly there's going to be no pelican birds in the summer you have gold finch and perhaps in the winter you have birds such as uh, robins. Now, homes. You are now able to purchase up to 12 homes and we are st still not too sure whether it means 12 homes and a number of businesses or 12 buildings in, uh, in t t total. But basically, most of, most of these buildings that you purchase all give you different types of spe special perks which actually come with the houses. These homes will basically act like it's some sort of Forza Horizon hub. So basically you'll be able to purchase c c c c c cars, paint y your cars, sell your cars on the auction house and even upgrade your c c cars in in your home. Your c c c c car is going to be outside and this will uh, outside of your house which will also mean that it, it, even during you doing really accurately very detailed paintwork you actually get natural lighting bouncing onto your c c c car just just so that you know exactly if your design is actually going to look good in in the world of Forest Horizon 4 or not. 
animals. So now Fortnite is, for, is now using full on free roaming animals. Now, this was a feature in, in Forza Horizon 3. However, it was very rare that, that, that you actually saw the animals. And also, these animals were more likely not really meant to be moving very much. Whereas in this game, you have sheep, chickens, potentially cows, rabbits, and birds, and probably more taxi coming once when the game gets launched, which will completely free running. You have sheep running all over while you try to run them over, but unfortunately you cannot. Mo moving on to uh, c c c cars, so we are going to have over 450 cars from the st st start, and if you if you order the game right now, you you'll get a chance to get the full game with with a formula drift car pack. Now this this includes seven c c cars that have been in the world famous formula drift championship. Including a over 1,000 horsepower twin turbocharged Dodge Viper, a, a B and B, E30 M3, two Nissan S14 Sylvia's. We'll also have a Nissan S15 Sylvia, a S13 240 SX a Mustang and a Holden Ute. On to the characters. So, so now you can change your c c characters appearance from things like shoes, trousers, shirts, hats and other accessories including a chicken suit. To be Customization again, another big part of of the Forza Horizon series, especially for this game, where we will be getting 30 new wide body kits from from the world famous companies such as Rocket Bunny, Liberty Walk, and all the way from Japan, RWB, which is famously known for going on Porsches. You will also be getting 12 new off-roading kits, which basically if, if feature massive b b ball bars, roof headlights, and some wide arches. There will also be a new feature called Wheel Track with also known as sp 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 Spaces, which will be fitted to around 150 c c c c cars. Most of these c c cars that will have it will be old c c cars since that their wheels will be further in the wheel arch than the c c c c cars of this generation. There will also be a new f feature c c c c coming in which is the drift suspension as well as we, we might be seeing things on the lines of drag tyres and suspension as well. Super wheel spins. So these are basically just like uh, with fairness wheel spins that have been in the Forza Horizon series. Basically if you don't know what these Horizon wheel spins are, basically you Every time you level up, you get a spin and you, and you get a chance of winning either money or perhaps a free c c car. Now, these are just like that, except it has three rolls, which means you've got an option of winning a whole load of money, a very expensive free c c cars, and some other accessories, such as uh, potentially accessories for your car or accessories for your person. For example, emotes or perhaps clothing. So, the Horizon st st Story Mode. Basically, 
usually in the past horrors and games you've had to basically the whole st story behind all these games which basically there's no story of it whatsoever it's basically uh, you go from bottom to the top doing lots of races, getting lots of money, getting lots of fans now you can follow that rule however now you, you've actually got yourself different kinds of jobs you can do such as being in charge of a world's fastest taxi company or perhaps doing st stunts for a TV magazine which we still don't know exactly what which one it is driving physics different s s s season will affect your sk skills quite a bit more than what Forza Horizon 3 was like thanks to the fact that it now comes with snow as well as thick mud and dirt roads and tarmac also you will be able to c go up steepest that you've ever been in any Forza game but also the highest that you've ever been in any Fox again thanks to the massive mountain hills right the horizon life also known as the online life so basically you will have a lot of features such as you will get to live a horizon life with up to 72 72 plays pretty much in your entire world however this means that everyone who is not in your online s s s session you will be able to see however they will be ghosted if they even man if they even t t try to touch your c car or try to ram you which is amazing because I've had enough of people ramming me speed zones and drift z z zones once when you get into these Z -z -z zones of the traffic cars and everything will be ghosted so that you can try and get the best sc score that you can. There will also be a new quick ch 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 chat f f feature as well as the online photo mode which pretty much if you go into a photo mode all of the cars freeze and your c c c car does but your car gets f ghosted so that everyone else who's online can just keep on going and that same goes for for a new online rewind mode which is where you get ghosted on everyone else's sc screen while you go backwards while everyone just carries on with their race or whatever what they are doing also if you online you will you will also have a ch ch chance to be absolutely f f f free by having no proper AI cars. Right, famous Forza Fun, also known as Forza Fun Live now. So, the new f f f f f Forza Fun events will go into three different options. We'll have one that happens every single week one that happens every single day and it was even going to be one that happens every single hour if you are so addicted to getting these prizes now all of these events will also get counted or into Forza points which will also get, 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 get linked into this Forza sh shop where you are able to purchase exclusive prizes which you would not be able to get with your Forza points so it's just like a normal auto show however these are thought to be exclusive with car mastery basically perks from Forza Horizon 2 and Forza Horizon 3 will go on as the same way as, as what is going on in here at Forza Horizon 4. However, 
these perks you will have to work a lot harder now as you will only be able to get perks for only one c c c c c car so you have lots of perks but only for like one of each car and if you buy a second c c c car which you know all, all already has those perks sadly you'll have to restart with that car and get your perks back but if you put if you put put a car with all the perks on the auction house you can actually get your car sold for more money than than as per usual the showcase events one of the most famous parts of the Fast Horizon series so far we have we've only heard of four different types of <laughs> showcase events with seen one that features a bike race as well as one that where you can race against a hovercraft which is going over some crazy mountains however we've found out that there are two other bonus ones which also feature doing races against a, a massive train and also with a pelican which for those who don't know like even I don't know because I don't I I don't really play Halo but 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 let's just say that the pelican is a giant spaceship from Halo. Lastly though we have the endurance races so as for Forza Horizon 1, Forza Horizon 2 and Forza Horizon 3 Forza Horizon 1 and 2 had the Horizon finale which was basically a race that went pretty much around almost the entire map in Forza Horizon 3 we did have that but it but the name was changed towards Regal Life Race. Now in Frost Horizon 4 we have five endurance races. One that is called the the World Famous Goliath, which is from Frost Horizon 3, as well as the Colossus, the Marathon, the Titan, and the Gauntlet. And that is everything that I've got for you guys. So I will help enjoy what watch this video if you did please smash that like button subscribe and click on the bell so you know exactly when it upload the next video as well as to c c comment down below do you think there's anything there that i've missed out because if so just write it down in the c c c c c comment section down below and i may do a part two anyway apart from that guys i like to thank you for this for watching this video and I'll see you in the next video.